Our current generation is extremely worried about carbon emissions and its impact on global warming in the long run. Out of all the other reasons, aircrafts and jets are the ones who contribute to the highest carbon emissions. However, electric plasma engines might really turn the course of our higher carbon footprint and become a game changer in the fight against global warming. What are these electric plasma engines that everyone is talking about? How is it going to help lessen our carbon footprint in the near future? Join us as we dive into the electrifying world of aviation's future. Is it just me or every other famous person I see is traveling to a lot of places on their private jets and flaunting their rich lifestyle? But how much do they care for the carbon emissions that they're causing while traveling to and fro every other day? Whatever may be the answer, we know that private jets offer extreme convenience and comfort, but it comes at a very great expense to the environment. And this is where the electric plasma engines come into action. Electric plasma engines have great potential. They can propel an airplane or a jet faster than a traditional engine ever could, all without burning an ounce of fossil fuel. And the best part? At a low cost. So how does an electric plasma engine work? An electric plasma engine uses a propulsion system and of course, uses plasma, a highly ionized gas to generate thrust. The engine, unlike engines that run on fossil fuels, starts by ionizing a working gas like air or some other suitable gas to create plasma. Now, a high voltage electric discharge is applied to the gas, which makes it highly ionized or energized. The plasma generated as a result is then directed and controlled using a magnetic field which then shapes it and prevents it from diffusing and maintaining its structure. The same plasma gets confined by the magnetic field which is then accelerated through a nozzle. While the plasma passes through the nozzle, it expands and gets expelled at high velocities in a specific direction creating a jet of hot ionized gas. When this plasma gets expelled at high velocities, a reaction force called thrust gets created in the opposite direction. This thrust is what is supposed to be used to propel an aircraft or even a spacecraft which may provide necessary propulsion for flight. Now, imagine a future where aircraft take inspiration from the stars themselves. But first, hit that like button and subscribe to our channel today. Researchers from the Technical University of Berlin are on a groundbreaking mission to turn science fiction into a reality. They're working tirelessly to bring plasma jet engines out of the research labs and into the vast skies that lie above us. Since traditional engines burn Burn fuel and compressed air to create forward thrust, plasma jet engines harness the unbelievable power of plasma and literally mimics the processes of a fusion reactor or a star. Led by visionary Burkant Goskell, this team is too excited about the things they might discover, like uniting the plasma engines with passenger jets creating a marvel that can soar to an incredible altitude while maintaining the ability to take off and land gracefully. Something similar is being researched at Wuhan University in China. Professor Zhuo Tang, a renowned polymath and former Caltech and Bell Labs employee who has a lot of research in his name, ranging from nanotechnology to artificial photosynthesis, found something crazy when he was investigating the use of microwaves in synthetic diamond production. He thought to himself, why not incorporate a similar technology to generate thrust? And this is how he and his co-scientists created a prototype thruster capable of generating plasma jets with propulsive forces comparable to traditional jet engines, but without the need of fossil fuels. In their experiments, the researchers achieved plasma temperatures exceeding 1000 degrees Celsius and estimated jet pressures equivalent to those produced by commercial jet engines. Professor Tang says, we could lift a steel ball weighing about 1 kg using only about 400 watts of microwave power. Now if you scale up the system to match the power and air intake of a standard jet engine, it could lead to a remarkable feat, achieving jet propulsion solely through electricity and air. This means bye-bye fossil fuel, which again means no carbon emissions. Although the research is still in its initial days, Tank thinks that within five years, one could use scaled-up plasma to power small pilotless airplanes or heavy-duty drones to carry cargo for shopping. Why can't we use it on bigger jets immediately? Well, for air plasma to power a large jumbo jet, it would require a large array of megawatt microwave sources, high-powered turbine compressors, and extremely high electric energy storage capability, something that might take years to develop. Let us know your thoughts in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Stay tuned for the next interesting video. Does this mean that the future looks bright with a greener footprint? What do you guys think of this development? Comment your thoughts below.